everybody I'm just going to show you how to make a piece of artwork finding things that are, are outside maybe in your garden out your front door just collecting things what are interesting so I'm going to look around our space and see Ooh, that's a nice twig over here a bit like a hedgehog. Lovely shapes. range of things that are all different shapes hopefully I can create some artwork now we've got our things together what we found outside you might be looking in your garden or just out your front door we're going to create a picture using the shapes of the things that we found outdoors outside so I picked four of my favorite shapes there I'm going to start with this first one the leaf shape and if you have any bits of paper or any old pieces of wallpaper any colors that's okay and I'm just going to try and tear the shape of the leaf which is a bit of an oval shape it doesn't have to be exact at all so you can just compare the shapes it's similar a bit oval then we're gonna stick down the shape that we've designed you might use scissors it's up to you you've got scissors at home and you can choose where you're going to place it on your paper so that's the first design on the paper the next one i'm going to look at is this rock shape which a bit like a triangle like three three um sides and i'm going to choose a different color if you're struggling you could even wrap something round it to get the shape and cut it out. So now I've done a basic shape, I'm just going to cut round that area. And again, choose, it is quite similar, choose the space where you'd like to place it. We've got two different shapes from things that we've found. Now I've chosen all the shapes that I found outside and tried to draw them on the paper using scissors and tearing. I've got the shapes and now what I'm going to do is draw around, make a pattern around the shapes. I'm using felt tip pens. You might have chalks at home or coloured pencils or crayons, whichever you feel comfortable with. And all I'm going to do is draw a careful line around the shape and do this really slowly. And it's a lovely, relaxing exercise to do. And it might be that you use one colour for each shape. I'm going to repeat this again until you've got a lovely pattern going round the shape. And this is like an abstract piece of art using shapes from objects that you found in your garden. And that will be just repeated till I fill all the white space on my paper. Fifth shape now, which is a completely different shape, but again, doing the same thing, drawing around carefully the shape using a line and I'm going to do this again so you build up that design of the shape of the things that you found in your garden or outdoors on your wall so this is where we're at at the moment and as you can see all them linear designs are filling up that page you might have a different coloured background it doesn't matter you can make all the decisions on the colours and the design 
So now I'm just going to make decisions on these last little bit um, of areas here. You have to think about where your design is going to overlap and not to run into the next design. So on this one, I'm just going to continue with the blue line, taking it over to the edge. And I'm stopping there and then I'm going back to this design here. But that's entirely your choice how you do it. And I'm sure that you're going to come up with some great designs and we'd love to see them. Now I, I've done this rather quickly but you are going to take a long time. And then we'll just fill in the last two areas and I'll make the decision of which uh, pattern and what colour I'll make. Now I've finished my design, I can't wait to see what things you've found and what designs you've made and share them with us. Have fun everybody.